Okay, let's see how to bake, because in the previous video I commented that you can do it from both sides, but there is a little caveat that you need to know. It's when we use the soup IK system here, is that we need to activate this when we are in the stance pose. It's important, because if not, we will create offsets when we activate all the constraints. So in order to do that, we just need to go to the stance pose here. So we have this, so we activate then, and now we can go to uh, the, um, the motion capture data that you have and to or in order to prove that I'm just gonna go here I'm not gonna use it much I'm just gonna show you that yeah, it's slightly off but you can see now the, the IK in one leg and the FK it's in the other leg it's working as, as expected so now we can do the bake you can come here to the bake and bake so that will bake your keyframes and turn off your human IK mapping. So you can see here now it's uh, to none. So basically it means that what you see here it's in your controls. There is a keyframe uh, in the um, in the mockup data. So you can see here DFK, the there's a little offset there, but in general this will properly bake your animation from one side to the other. Obviously from here you need to adjust your animation or if it comes clean from Motion Builder, probably you need to do less work. Okay, so that's it how we bake the animation.